It is a big weekend in Newton as IndyCar Race Weekend arrives at the Iowa Speedway. The races and big concerts kick off tomorrow, but today is for the fans with Free Family Friday. WHO 13's Roger Riley was checking out the crews getting ready for the per first practice today. Hi, Roger. Yeah, hi, Aaron. You know, here at the Iowa Speedway, there's a lot to do for the crews for the practice laps today. and. There are many things that they may need to kind of adjust on the cars and make the car perform at its best. Yeah, so it's the opening day of Hy-Vee IndyCar Race Weekend 2024. Certainly a lot of interest and attention is being put on what we see on track here today because there's a new repave, a partial repave of this circuit. And it really makes a big difference for how the cars behave, right? So very, very smooth through the corners, repaving through the corners. So with Indy cars, very sensitive in, in terms of how the surface responds, how the cars respond to the surface. Uh, today for the crews, they need to see uh, what setup on each car works best. They can control what kind of tires they use, what kind of downforce works best. And the big change here is a new hybrid engine, which helps produce more power. The engines debuted last week on a road course. This is the first oval they've, been, they've used the hybrid on. It allows it to, much like a hybrid in a car, a little bit different, but it creates that uh, extra energy. In a place like Iowa Speedway, it, it's not as used as much as it would be on a road course where you have a longer lap time and you have long, more recovery time to utilize that hybrid power. Uh, so they won't be using it as much, but it is still something new and different that the teams need to get used to and get comfortable with this weekend. Yeah, Merrill Kane said that uh, they appreciate hy V's work in integrating the concerts with the racing because it exposes uh, music fans that may never come to IndyCar. Meanwhile, the fan experience we talked about, the gates opened at 2, and I caught up with some of those fans. We'll bring that to you next hour, Aaron. Okay, looking forward to it. Thanks, Roger.